She did something that in our society is unspeakable. She kissed a black man. Do you believe in equal rights for women? I should say not. I warn you that a wicked law like cholera destroys everyone it touches. Classic American movies and the courthouse. The two became linked once early filmmakers found out that courtroom theatrics make for stirring big screen drama. We had a contract that was imposed on us. Pierce O'Donnell has represented Art Buckwald and Faye Dunaway. The gavel is like the clabber, the light, okay? The light's gone on and it's action, it's drama. On his first day of law school, O'Donnell watched the Academy Award winning A Man for All Seasons. The law requires more than an assumption. The best courtroom sagas on the silver screen do receive critical acclaim. I'm quite concerned about the lost paintings. George C. Scott earned a Best Supporting Actor nomination as the tough prosecutor in Anatomy of a Murder. There are certain things you can do and certain things you cannot do. And people seem to like that orderliness and just however much chicanery that goes on inside the, those boundaries is what makes it fascinating, I assume. Abby Mann won an Academy Award for his judgment at Nuremberg screenplay. It's morality and it's a suspense. It's a, it's a built-in conflict. And uh, uh, one is always interested in that kind of thing, you know, in, 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 in that kind of tug of war. The most recent legal tug of war on film, Murder in the First. Is it not true that you ordered two guards to throw Henry Young down a steel flight of stairs? That you With Christian Slater as the attorney who takes on Alcatraz. I've always thought that uh, lawyers are... Uh, entertainers really at heart and, and uh, speech makers and uh, performers. He or she must be a good writer. We write our own material. You have to direct your own performance and that of the other people in your cast. You must be a producer and know how to stage the proceedings and ultimately you must be a fine actor. But are classic courtroom films accurate? High-profile Los Angeles attorney Howard Weitzman's favorites include A Few Good Men, The Verdict, and Inherit the Wind. He says older law movies were less realistic. I think they felt they had to pump up the drama a bit. However, yeah. traditionally, films take great license with how lawyers conduct themselves and the questions they would be able to ask. And in real life, for the most part, it doesn't happen that way. Still, the classic trial movies endure the critics' toughest cross-examination.